get ready, find a comfortable spot in the living room, garage, wherever you're doing it, feet together, tap disc. Let's get ready for a fun training session. All right, guys, let's go from here. We're going to uh, start with high knees. Let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Good. Roll your foot. One, two, three, four, five. Other way. One, two, three, four, five. Other foot. One, two, three, four, five. Other way. One, two, three, four, five. Jumping jacks 20 times. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, twenty. Good. Ten push ups. Let's do it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. On your feet. And then crisscross. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, twenty. Squats ten times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Good. Let's go here now. Shuffle legs forward and back. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Okay? Circle your foot. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Switch. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Figure eight. One, two, three, four, five, six. Try to keep your balance. Seven. If you drop it, skip back at it. Eight. Other way. Eight, seven, six, five. Keep going. Four, three, two, and one. Bring it up and over. One, two, three, four. Try not to drop it. Five, six, up and then open. Seven, eight, other way. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Good job. Other foot, you feel the burn in the opposite hip. Ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Switch. One, two, three, Four, five, six, seven, eight. Figure eights. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Other way. Eight. Do a little trick here. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Up straight. Open it up. One. Go to ninety degrees. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. And eight, switch directions. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Good job. Shake it off. Hands side to side. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Get low, open and close. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight, close open. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Good. Shake it off. Swing your back leg up. Ready? One, two, nice and easy. Three, four, five, six. We'll go to eight, seven. Swing it. Eight. Switch legs. One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Good. Let's go circular. Left leg in the front. Right leg left to right. One, circle. Two, three, four, 
one more, five. Switch, left leg, uh, right to left. One, two, three, four, five. Good, touch your toes and come up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, good, move your arms forward, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, switch, one, two, as a direction, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, side to side, one, two, three, keep switching, which one's on top, four, five, six, seven, and eight, turn the body, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. All right, let's get into our, let's go through our basics, get the body warmed up a little bit more, and repeat those basics. So let's put our left leg in front, shoulder width apart, front toes facing forward, hands come up in the fighting position, elbows go in, butt tilts back slightly. Remember, little tilt, half the weight on each of your feet, half here, half here, it's 50-50 this way, it's also 50-50 this way. Sometimes we're too much in the front, many times we're too much in the back. Especially if we're a bit nervous, right? Stand your ground. That's where you're strong. Okay? Half and half. Ready? Let's go left and right to start. Four times to the left. One, closest foot first. This one goes the same size. Two, three, look at your opponent. Watch their shoulders. Four, if you're new, you might want to watch your feet. One, see? Two, so they don't get any narrow, narrow, more narrow than they start. Three, four. Let's go left. One, two, working on the elbows in. Three, four, Good, and working on not going up or down. One, see, same height. Two, three, four, left, left, left. You should feel always ready to jab. Every jab cross, kick, sprawl, all right? All right, let's go forward now. Ready, four times. One, two, keep the same angle. Three, four, stop. No tension in the body. Every muscle is not flexed at all. Let's go backwards, back. Back, for the newer people, make sure your fingers, then your thumbs. Okay, back and back. Let's go forward. One, two, stop. Make sure you're not in a straight line. Open up. Three, four, left, back, forward, right. Now, do you guys remember the two tough directions? Just to review, okay? The tough ones are right and, and forward for right hands. Okay, so from here, when you step, you'll many times you touch your heel first. You need to put the ball of the foot first, you see? Go. And when you go forward, to touch the heel first. See? Put the ball first. Okay? Let's do, let's do a few more of those. Ready? And for lefties, the difficult ones are this way. And forward. Okay? Let's go. Forward. Forward. Watch it. This is a tough one. Right. Right. Back is easy. Can't get that one wrong unless you're narrow. Left. Left. All right. Let's go 10 jab. Nice and easy. Move your head a little today. Let's get a little rock and roll today. Everybody rock forward, rock back. Okay, set the body in motion. Ready? One, two, exhale. Three, as soon as it hits, it's back to where it started. Four, it's not a big deal if I miss. Five, six, try to catch a jab as you're rocking in. Seven, when I move, my hands don't move independently of my face, see? Sometimes we allow these to move too. It messes everything up. So I've never taught you to punch from here, right? Or here. Or here, right? When you move, look, it's always the same. Make sense? That's a you know, hidden detail. One, two, let's go jab cross. One, nice and loose. He comes back to that same position. Two, if my hands were somewhere else, I'd feel wrong. You have to make the wrong stuff feel wrong, right? Sometimes the right position can feel wrong. It's like, oh, my elbow's kind of tight. Ready? Five, keep your head locked in. Why is my chin down? Right? If they hit me, it's going to be up here, strong. Here's tucked in, hard to hit. If you're like that, boom. One, two, get a rocking motion. Three, let's go kick with the right leg, front kick. One, drop the kicking hand. Two, three, as soon as you land, back to your stance. Why don't you move a little now? Work on your movement. Ready? While I'm not counting, I want you moving. Chin down, four, five, 
Just throw the knee. Step with your left leg. Grab. Reach across. Protect. One. Get them warmed up. Two. Point the toes and pull the heel back. Three. Four. Five. Good. Let's do a switch knee. We're going to switch the legs and then we're going to knee. So as we switch, we have to reach. Okay. One. Step back and back. Two. Switch. Knee. Behind. Behind. Three. Four. Five. Six. Good. Let's go here. Two front kicks. One. Kick. Kick. Shuffle back. Three times. Ready? Again. Move your head. Get that rock and roll. One. Kick. Kick. Shuffle. Shuffle. Pinch the elbows. Bring your head down in your hands. Kick. Kick. Shuffle. Shuffle. Let's go knee. Double knee. 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 Shuffle. Move back. Got it? Let's go. Two. Knee. Knee. Shuffle. Shuffle. Keep it going. One more time. Knee. Knee. Shuffle. Back. Punch it out for 10 seconds. Go. 10. 9. 8. 7. 6. 5. 4. Loose. 3. 2. And 1. Okay. Let's just go over quickly our jab counters. That's part of our, our basic warm up here. Hands up. You guys remember how to block the jab one way? Pick it and jab back. Okay? We don't want to turn our shoulders like this when we block. This is very common. People turn this. Okay? You need to keep maximum reach. Look at the reach here. It's already shorter than it was here. We don't have time to go back, turn and come back. You guys, like, you're just as skilled as you. Okay? You need to pick, jab back right away. Ready? One, pick, jab. Two, three, bring the hand back to your face. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay? Good. Before we get into these sequences, let's do another counter. Okay, block the low kick. Let's bring our leg up, up and out. 45 degrees, weight on the back leg. Okay, solid, don't drop it, place it down. Ready? One, lift it, place it down. I don't want you to lift it and have any drop it. Two, I like to flex my foot. Some people do extend it, some people bend it this way. I like flex and just here solid. So they want, I want them to kick the land here. Okay, don't go too high or they'll kick your other leg and you go flying. I just want to bind feet on my leg here. Okay, ready? On the bad side. Here we go. One, check, step down, cross, hook, cross. So this is a review from the basic classes, okay? If you're new, I wouldn't start on lesson 20, uh, 80. Go back to number one all the way through. Let's stick with us today. So get all the basics now, ready? One, check. So we can make that automatic. Two, check. Good. Three, check. Box, and then look at it. Four, check. Five, invite the kick. Six, check. So one way to counter. Seven, check. Eight, check. Two more. Nine, small check. Good. Ten, check. And jumping jacks. Go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Grab a sip of water, and then we're going to get on to today's content. Good work. Okay, we're going to do wedge blocking today. So we're going to kind of touch upon a bunch of different blocking techniques today. Okay, blocking and counter, counter punching techniques, counter attacking techniques. All right, hands up. So, fighting stance, we see the right hand coming in, we block, okay? My hand goes up, touches my head. You don't block like this ever because you're gonna beat yourself up. That's like your big brother, you see grab your fist and hit you with it, right? Your own fist. So here, cover. Take the punch on the arm, don't be straight. This is the hole here, make sure you block. The center line is small, okay? 
let's wedge block, block and come back across and across. We're going to do 10 times. Ready? We've done this in the past. One. Wedge block. One, two, three. That's it. Two. So one punch, and we give them a three in return. Three. Feel the turning of the body. Four. Turning the core, the hips. Your butt is back. Too many people are straight. Okay, a few of you are straight out there. You need to be back and you're going to push something. Ready? Five. Right back to the frame. Six. Seven. Eight. Close together with the feet, not too far. Nine. One more. Ten. All right, we're gonna, he's going to go out of range of our punches. We're going to step with our right foot to the corner. Can you guess it? Nice and tall. We're going to turn our body and then throw our swing kick all the way around, ending up with our feet essentially side by side so we don't stop our kick like a baseball bat. Ready? Let's go. One. Wedge. One, two, three. Step out. Kick. And reset. Okay. And while you're resetting, guys, don't worry. It's not like you're going to get rush to go through it again. Get back to your rock and roll. Chin down. It's your time to think about that. Two. We'll go a little faster on the higher sets. Let's get the body warmed up. Three. Good. Reset. Four. Step outside. Kick. And just let it swing. Five. Good. Six. Come back nice and loose. Back to that stance. Seven. You're starting to notice you got all the tension going much easier. Eight. Nine. Now remember, when we start turning, you go flat, but as you kick, you raise a bit. So you can pin it. If you try to pivot with all that flesh on the ground, it's very sticky, you can put pressure on your knee. It's not going to be as fast, not as powerful. Okay? Now, we're going to do two kicks. So we got to control, it's not going to be a spin. One, lock. One, two, three, step, kick, behind, kick, behind, and back. Okay? Two. Three. Behind and then back. Four. Control, control, and back. Five. Boom, boom, back and back. And punch it out. Let's go. 20 seconds. Inch your way forward. Let's go. Just start to feel the whole body getting warm now. And time. Walk it off. 15 seconds, we'll start back at the top. Good work. So this, I like to call this the wedge block. Truthfully, in my style of fighting, I like to move my head more than blocking. But it's important in all the skills. Sometimes you don't have time to move. Sometimes, you know, you choose to block for a different purpose. Sometimes you're stuck on a cage, maybe you can't move. Okay, here we go. It depends on your opponent. The more skilled you're, you are, and your opponent is less striking skilled, you can play all the tools very, very often, very easily. But that being said, sometimes if they're not that skilled, you can't pull out some things because they punch in a weird fashion, weird technique. So you stick to the basics. All right? Better fighters bring out the better techniques from you. Hands up. It's wedge block, cross and cross. Rocking, we're working on that rocking motion today. I don't want to see you in your living room like this. Look. That's lesson one. What am I doing? No. You guys are getting smooth. Let's go. Ready? One. A less talking now. Let's let it rip. Two. When you're done, fix the elbows. Three. Now you'll feel it. Get that speed. Four. You can only punch as fast as your torso can turn. And that's why we're close with our legs. Five. Loose. Six. Good. Seven. Three more. Eight. Lift that elbow. I gotta lift mine as well. 
bit more. Nine. That one felt better. Ten. What was our next move? Follow with the left kick. They back that in your range. If they go far, don't just keep punching. Next one, the next weapon here. Okay, here we go. One. Come back, reset. Rock and roll while you're waiting. I know this doesn't mean put your hands down while you're waiting. Guard. Two. Three. Don't think of a kick separate than a punch. It's just another limb. It's not going to be great punches and then we stop. No, I'm going to kick somebody. Just let it flow. Five. Six. Good, stay tall. Seven. Nice and loose. Eight. Imagine putting that leg on him. Game over. Nine. One more. All right? Ten. All right. Let's follow a double kick. So this is assuming the first one hit him, and then we hit him again, like a baseball bat. Okay? Here we go. One. Kick, back, kick. This challenges your balance. Sometimes we kick, we put too much forward, and we can't put it behind. Stay centered. Two. Good. Three. Two more. Four. They get all that after one punch for them. Five. And back. Punch it up. Let's go. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, elbows in, five, four, three, two, and one. Lock it up. Let's do it all again. We're just going to alternate uh, all three. Ready? Quick recovery. Here we go. Ready? Hands up. We'll block and punch. One. I'll do it forward first. Now add the kick. Two. Now add the double kick. Three. Okay, let's go. Different directions. One. Two. Should I just turn this way now so I don't have to keep spinning? Three. You can step forward after that one if you want. You can come in with some hands. Again, one. I'll do that again. I lost my balance in that one again. One, two, three, forward or back and back. And let's do one more time. One, two. Three. And punch it out. Let's go. Ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. And one. On your stomach. Regular push-ups. Twenty times. With me. Ready? One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten more. Nine. Eight. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. 30 seconds, grab a drink. On to the next set. We're going to wedge block with the other arm. Okay, we're going to wedge block on the other side, and we're going to come back with uh, three punches. It's going to set up our right kick. You guys ready? Hands up. So, 
You might remember, that's a good way to train. As you train, sometimes I'll be doing something, I'm about to start it, and you're like, I know what's coming, and bam, you were right. Or boom, you were wrong, okay? Well, that's, that's the progression, okay? Start to recognize patterns, ready? Hands up, now they're gonna hit us on this side. Sometimes it's a jab, you can use it, I don't use it as much on that, or a hook, okay? You're gonna wedge here. But you need to turn your heel, two purposes. One, to make sure you block the center line, and two, you tell me exactly to set up the left hand or even left kick. Okay, so you turn in and now you wound it up and unwind. Okay, we're gonna go hook, cross hook. So like I said, for the newer people, we, build, we do these in the earlier lessons, like breaking down with single punches. Right now, we're just gonna rip that we know, we understand. Ready? One, lock, hook, cross hook. Elbow high, thumb up. Just for the quick details, thumb up, elbow high is the punch. Foot turning. What's that motion called, guys? T-frame. Ready? One. Lock. Take your time. First set. Two. Three. Stay right in the center. Remember your hook just hits. It comes back the same trajectory. That's hard. Ready? Five. Comes back right to position. Start in position. Chin down. How's your chin? Six. Seven. Eight, cover. Two more. Nine. Ten. Nice work. Okay. Follow this with a right kick. So, on your hooks, you might not want to turn your foot anymore. Okay? So, on the first punch, you can keep it down. See? That way we're going to be able to kick right away. If we dig into like a classical boxing hook in this case, it's hard to kick. Okay? So you just want to kind of rip without turning that foot as much. Ready? One. And again, we're shooting for that half turn. Take a step, toes open, turn the chest, then kick. Two. Three. Let it flow. Four. I'll turn my chest a little more before. Ready? Five. Got a much easier time spinning when you turn that chest. Wind it up. Six. When you feel the good ones, you're going to know, right? Seven. Eight. Good cardio when you start mixing those legs in. Nine. One more. Ten. Good. Now we're going to do a double kick with that leg. Same as the other side. Okay? Hands up. One. Block. Hook. Cross. Hook. Step. Kick. Down. Kick. Back. Got it? Two. Three. Look, I keep my shoulder. I keep my foot turned. I touch, put it behind, touch. Your hand can swing on each kick. Four. Five. And back. And let's go high knees. Ten. Nine. Eight. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and time. Ten seconds, we'll do it again. Repeat, 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 repeat. All the time. Now you guys are sending messages, you're starting to feel uncomfortable with the combos. It's perfect. It just takes time. Never get frustrated. It's good to feel that. It's good to feel that like you see comments, oh man, I can't get that. That's the inspiring part. You came out and you nailed this whole workout the first time, huh? All right, let's go. One. Just the hands. Two. So second set, get the hands a little quicker now. Three. We're at the mercy of how fast we can turn this thing though, right? Anybody can just do this with arms. Four. You see, turn. Try a few without turning in case you want to kick. Five. 
You can generate that power. Six. Still pretty strong. And truthfully, when I, when, as you box, even boxers, you'll see a lot of boxers don't turn their foot. Because they know how to generate the power, even without the foot. Boom! It's all in the core. So you learn maximum, and then you can hit just as hard, if not harder, without the maximum turn. Okay? That makes sense. Ready? Two more. One. So when you're learning, let's turn it. Two. Add the right kick. One. Back to your stance, rock and roll. Two. Beautiful. Back to the movement, look at your opponent. Three. Chin down the whole time. As soon as you step close to your partner, right? As soon as that fight begins, boom. Right down. Five. Same thing, I come home, my wife's mad at me, boom, chin down. I should pop me right in, the, right in the cheek. She's not in right now. I'm just saying no. Seven. Boom. And back. Eight. Good. Let it flow. Nine. Remember, don't turn the foot on the second hook. Ten. Double kick. One. Kick back. Kick. Back, back. Two. Three. Almost lost my self there. Four. One more. Five. And high knees. Go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight, nine, and ten. Walk it off, and then we'll alternate all three. Deep breath in through your nose. Should have some sweat going now. Hope I'm not the only one. And I hope you're not on the couch watching this workout. Jump in, my friends. Work at your own pace. If it's a little advanced for you, do a few, skip a few. Jump back in, in and out. Or you can do some of your early moves that you know. A little more, you know, uh, a little more um, comfortable. Here we go. One, just the hands. Now we add the kick. Two, now we add the double kick. Three, control your weight. Beautiful. One, two, three. Two more. One. Two. Getting me to the legs. Three. One more. One. Two. Three. Back. Comfortable. High knees. Go. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and wide grip push ups. 20 with me. Ready? Extra wide. And go. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 9, 8. Come on. 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. All right. 30 seconds to a minute. Get a drink. On to the next one. Okay, we're going to start off, let's block the uppercut today. This one's a new skill. There's a lot of ways to deal with the uppercut. This one's got to be fast. There's an opening them up, you kind of open yourself up too. 
Okay, but we know, we feel it when we're gonna block it. And it's a very small motion, okay? Hands up. So, we're gonna start with our front hand block. Okay, so we're gonna see what side I wanted to teach first. So, uppercut's coming here. And it's taking advantage of the fact that the chin is down, see? It's gonna catch you. It's hard to uppercut someone that's kind of straight and a little crummy here, you know, or unorthodox. Sometimes it can be good here. You know, like a traditional fighter, it can be a little awkward, they're good at this position. But they are open more for straight punches. Person's a little bit more squat down here, boom, uppercuts. So you'll change as the fight goes. Okay? But some crummy fighters, they don't mean to do it here. They're just up straight like that. It's hard to uppercut them because they're not even bent. Okay? So, ready? I'm bent a little bit. Comfortable, you can throw an uppercut. Turn your left hand like this. Okay, very small. So if you face me, it's not a big deal. Ready? Boom. His hand will come here, but you cannot get up high enough. My wrist will stop his wrist. Okay? So let's go, front hand, and then you guys guess it, cross hook. Boom, boom, that could be more punches, that's all we start with now. One, block, two, block, come back, three, ten times, block, this goes back to your face right away, so you can throw the hook, you don't want to be here, look. Four, one, pull it, boom, T-frame. Five, six, seven, Eight. Many times this is when you're stuck on the ropes. Uppercut comes, boom. Nine. One more. Ten. Okay, we're gonna come back with a switch knee. All right, let's go. One, block, cross, hook, keep that hand ready. Switch and grab and knee and back and back. Getting a little crazy now, here we go. Two, block, cross, hook, Switch, grab, knee, step forward. Let's do step forward for today. Four, block, five, good, six, seven, Start dropping the elbow now. After your knee, step forward, long, lift your back heel, protect, turn the hand as you step, down, and then cut on the eyebrow. Turn your foot and your shoulders. Ready? Five more. One. Okay, we're just frying the brain today, that's good. Two. Rock and roll. Three. Get your next move in your mind now while you're waiting. It's the block. It's the block. Ready? Four. One more. Five. Punch, punch, sprawl. Ready? One. One. Okay. If you're not sprawling, hard floor, injuries, soreness, do squat instead. Punch, punch, squat. And you can stay in your uh, uh, fighting stance. Everybody else, sprawl them back, or burpee. One. Two. Three. Stay loose. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Two more. Nine. Ten. And break. 20 seconds, do it again. Nice work. Okay, second set, we're just going to do the same thing, okay? Block the uppercut, here we go, hands up, one, block, cross hook, two, no, yeah, that's right, two, three, fire back a little more crisp now, Got that power. Four, 
Five. You gotta make your speed vicious. Six. Seven. Eight. Little cover, little cover. As soon as it touches, boom. Nine. Ten. All right, let's add the switch knee. One. Two. Three. Don't forget to grab. After that hook, hook, both hands. Four. One more. Five. Add the elbow. Shuffle back if you need space. Sometimes it's good to train a small living room. You have to turn. You have to go forward. You have to adjust for your space. Okay, hands up. One. Switch. Cover. Two. Just let it flow. If the wrong move comes out, it's fine. Next time you tune it back in. Three. Four. One more. I got a little tighter now. I got to loosen up. Five. And punch, punch, sprawl. One. Two. You can also do the hip sprawl. Like that. Three. Four. Five more. Four more. Three more. Two more. One more. And walk it off. Nice job. Get a shot of water. Okay. Sometimes you get thrown back in the match like this, with a little breath, with a little rubbery, because they gotta fight. So it's good sometimes go in and don't wait until you're fully recovered for this type of stuff. Sometimes you gotta get back in there and learn to punch, learn to be dangerous, even when you're tired, even when you're rubbery, even when you're breathing a little bit. You gotta train yourself to know that you can always be effective. Okay? And the better shape you get in, the harder it is to make you in that, put you in that state. But when you fight someone as good as you, you're always going to get there. Okay? Hands up. Here we go. Lock with the other hand now. So we're going to be doing this one first. Now we're going to block this one right up. The cut's coming. Boom. Okay? Why do we turn the heel? Make this powerful. Hook cross. Okay? So we block. Now we both have a hook here. You see? He has a left hook too. Right up cut, right? But I have to kind of have his wrist, you see? And also, I'm boom, boom. I know when it's touched, bam. But you gotta bring this as soon as it touches, it has to come back. Okay? And you can go here and then you both get hooked. All right? You ready? One, boom. And you kind of move your head away from the hook a little. You see? So it's not so, I have the powerful hook, not him. One, lock. You pull it back to your face. It's quick. Two. Are you standing still? It's wrong today, guys. Move the head a little. Three, four, five, six, good, that was a good one, I saw that one, seven, lift that elbow, eight, come out of here, let's go, nine, ten, we're all going to step now. After the right hand, we're going to step and knee with our left leg and step forward. Similar to the other one, except we don't have to switch. Ready? One. Lock. One. Two. Walk. Protect. And grab a knee. Pull to that side. Loosen. When you pull, don't tense. Pull. Sleepy. Okay? Everything's like that. Two. Sorry. The other block. Wedge. Two. Uppercut block. One. Two. Step. Knee. Boom. Okay, three, 
Shuffle back properly. Don't relax. I'm only walking back like this. Where are you going? Store? Come on. The whole stance, the whole time. Five. Again. Six. Shuffle back. Eyes on your opponent. Seven. At the elbow. You guessed it. Let's do it. Eight. Turn that back heel. Rotate the shoulders. Nine. Ten. Nice work, my friends. And what do we have? Punch, punch, crawl? Yeah, I think so. No, that was on the last one. We're okay. Let's go here. Just punch it out. Ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Turn the shoulders into five. Four. Three, shoe shot, two, one. All right, time. Walk it off. Good job. Let's drop in this to the next set of push ups right now. And then we'll go into another set of that. All right, let's do that. Let's do diamond. Ready? Feet apart wide. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight, haven't done this for a while. All right, let's go. Ten more. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Nice. Now you get up. Now you got to punch. You got to rely on relaxation. Now here we go. One, flop. Two punches. Rock and roll. Two, different angles. Three, four. Five, speed is power. Six, come on. Seven, eight, beautiful. Nine, ten, what do we have next? Exactly, step knee. You know what we have. One, protect. Two. Be loose. Three. Four. At the elbow. I'll we'll come back this way. Ready? One. Two. Do the body kick. So our body punch. Now we might have to remember a few lessons back. And like I said, if you haven't done them, you want to go back. Because there's a lot of stuff in here the lessons that I covered that I don't cover sometimes now, or once in a while. Maybe a quick blitz here and there. There's a lot of tools. When you watch a person fight, you only see a few of their tools. 
They might have all these other tools they didn't have to use because they just didn't come up that day. Too soft. So it's not always good to study the fights. I like to study people training. Bags, shadow box, hour long lessons. <laughs> this is the stuff where you learn, you know, in the fight, boom, sometimes you put them out right away because you have all the tools and that was a sharp one right there. Make sense? So try to get the training videos. Watch the training, watch the heavy bag, watch the shadow boxing, do the workouts, okay? Hands up, fighting stance. So, you guys remember how to block the body? We just dip and cover the floating rib. Ready? Little crunch, looks like nothing. Don't turn, don't do anything, just this here. Remember our first punch? Anybody? Uppercut, right? Because he's doing this, look. Okay, ready? One. Got it, let's go. Two, dip. Uppercut, hook, cross. Three. Four. Beautiful. Five, crunch. No turn, you're gonna to wanna to turn, this is crummy. Crunch, you're already perfect. Six, all right? Seven, crunch, don't come up. Turn from that height. Eight, all in the legs. Nine, 10, all right. I'm just creating, I'm not even looking at the game plan anymore. I'm going by feel. Now we're gonna roll our head after that and come back with a cross and a hook, okay? So head movement now from lessons before. One, wedge, uh, sorry, elbow block. Don't bend, don't lean, don't turn, don't turn. Just one, two, three, roll, cross, hook. Okay, you guys got it? Here we go. One. Good work, my friends. Two. I'm going a little faster for a set. We'll do faster next set. Three. Four. Roll with the legs and rip the cross hook. Five. All right, let's add the uh, right kick to the body after, okay? One, dip, one, two, three, roll, one, two, kick, half turn, got it? Two, perfect. Back to your stance, rock and roll it. Three, Four. Five. And punch it out. Let's go. Ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. And one. Time. Walk it off. Nice work. Okay, now we're gonna go the other side. Now this gets a little complicated, like I said, go a few lessons back, find the body, body work ones, find the rolling ones, head movement ones. We'll spend a lot of time isolating. Okay? You can learn this way too, if it's a little, a little too quick, it's a little quick. You have to have a good eye. Okay, here we go, hands up. Block the other side. You remember? Turn and block. Don't turn too much. <sighs> Lock the floating rib, boom. Upper, cross, hook, cross, okay? Let's do it. One. Don't even see the block, look here. I just lifted my heel to give my left hand power. Two. Try to get this to go here, not here. Sometimes mine are going here too. Boom, straight up. Three. Back to rock and roll. Four. Hit. Come out of that shell. Five. Make sure every cut is 90 degrees, not a little close thing like this. Ten. Lock yourself in. Stop it a little bit. Eleven. Bounce that last one back quick. I'm gonna do that myself here. Twelve. That felt better. That's when I kind of relieved it. Okay, we did a few extra. Let's follow with a left turning kick now. 
You ready? Oh no, sorry, the roll. Still in the roll. Let's do right, uh, roll, cross, and cross after that. All three points. One. Yep. Upper, cross, hook, cross, roll, cross, hook, cross. Okay, a lot of boxing there. What? Two. Upper, cross, hook, cross, drop the butt, cross, hook, cross, and all those punches. Let's go. Three. Look at it. Four. Block. Chin down. Hit this. That's not going to do right. Five. That's it. Looking good. Six. Bounce back. Remember it's a bounce back that does the damage. Seven. Add a stepping left kick now for last three. One. Block. One, two, three, four. Roll. One, two, three. Wind half turn. Ready? Two. One more. Three. Do one more, I didn't feel good on that one. One more. Center your belt. Four. That felt better. And punch it up for ten. Go. Ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Faster. Four. Three. Two. One. Lock it up. One minute break. We'll shout a box around. And then we'll finish up. Good job. Okay, I lied. We should probably do one more set of push-ups. How about we do Spider-Man? I hate these ones. My shoulder's killed. Eight, we'll do our best. Okay, you're gonna drop, and as you drop, you bring one knee to your elbow, then the other one. Okay? Last set of push-ups for the day. Here we go. Ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Ooh, Spider Man. Enough. Okay, short shadow boxing around today, three minutes. And then we'll finish up a little bit of ab work. I had this big lasagna today, and I gotta burn it off. Okay, let's go. Here we go. Three minute round. You ready, my friends? Let's go. Jab. Double jab. Jab the head, cross the body. You're going to find moves that we do and we're maybe 10 lessons ago. Jab the body, cross the head. Good. Jab. Jab that body shot. Spin off. Touch. Jab. Switch kick. Jab. Push kick. Jab. Push kick. Again, jab, push kick, jab right, low kick, boom, step, jump, half turn. Again, jab, turn, jab, chop, good, jab, cross, one, two, nice and loose shoulders, three, add a slip, one, one, two, slip, cross, hook, cross, two, one, two, slip, cross, hook, cross, three, one, two, Slip, cross, hook, cross. Follow the left knee, elbow. One, two, slip, cross, hook, cross, walk, knee, elbow, turn, jab, double, triple. That's always a good idea when you're thinking, jab, double, triple. One, two. Let's go through the bread and butter kicking combos. Ready? Jab, right, kick. One punch, 
One kick. Two punches, left kick. Two punches, left kick. Three punches with a hook, jab, cross hook. One, two, three, boom. Again, jab, kick, jab, cross, kick, half turn, jab, cross hook, kick, half turn. Four straight. Good sprawl or four squat. Good. Let's go. Jab, cross, left body shot. One, two, we're going to dip that head. Three, elbows in. Add the left hook. One, two, get back to the rock and roll. Three, add the right kick. One, half turn. Two, three, good sprawl. Get back up. Jab, double. Triple. One, two. Circle right. Cross across. And punch it out to the buzzer. 20 seconds. Come on, stay with me. Go faster than me. Let's go. Show me. Show me the hands. Work to the buzzer. Go! High five. Good work. Walk it off. Let's get right to it. On your backs. Ready? Those of you here, you guys can see me? Feel good? All right. 25 crunches. One, two, three, four, five, six, Seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, twenty. One, two, three, four, twenty-five. We're gonna crisscross, okay? You're gonna count with me. You with the jaws of t shirt on. Ready? Here we go. One, two, count with me at home. Three, four, five, six, seven. If you have that jaws of t shirt, you're counting me. Eight, nine, ten. One, come on, let's hear it. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five. Okay, we're gonna do single leg sit-ups now. You with the shorts on. Now you. You guys gonna go like this. One leg's gonna bend, you're gonna grab your leg and hug it, and then do the other side. Count with me. One, two, three, four. Let's hear it. Five. Need some help. Six, seven, hug it. Eight, nine, ten. Let's go. We have 25. One, two, three. Almost done. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, twenty. Five more leaves. One, two. Let's go with the short side. Count. Three, four, twenty-five. All right. Let's touch our ankles. Ready? One, two. Everybody count with me. Three, four, five. Six, make sure your body's moving. Seven, reach far. Eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four. Let's go. Five, six, seven, eight. Come on. Nine, twenty. One, two, three, four, twenty-five. You don't feel the bleach, you're doing it wrong. Hands in your butt. We're going to get to 200. Round one to 100 now. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Come on. Eight. Nine, ten, beautiful. One, two, all the ladies count with me. Three, four, five, all the ladies. Six, seven, eight, come on. Nine, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five. All the guys, let's go. Count with me at home. One, two, three, four. Come on, guys, I don't even hear you. Five, let's go. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. That's better. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. 8, 9, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25. Hold them in the air. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 20. 1, 2, 3, 4, 25. Triple sticks, triple sit ups. Sorry, triple hidden sit ups. 
Pitch your stomach, pitch your thighs, pitch your calves with the head. Ready? One. You got it. Two. Last 25 for the day. Three. Hit, hit, hit. Four. Five. That floating rib that we're protecting, ready? Condition it. Six. Seven. Condition, condition, condition. Eight. Nine. <coughs> Exhale into your stomach. <coughs> you tighten up. Where am I at? I don't even know. Should I start again? 12, I think. Let's go. 13. Let's go, my friends. 14. Hit, hit, hit. 15. Work. 16. Let's go. 17. 18. Give it a whack. 19. Work. 20. Yes, 21. Five more. We're done for the day. Two. Three. Hit, hit, hit. Four. Five. Five more. Let's go. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. What if it took five more to win? I think we got it. One. Let's go. We got it. Two. Three. Four. Five. What if I said ten more, you could be champ. One. Let's go. Last ten. Two. I promise it's at three. You have my word. Four. Come on. Five. Four more. Woo! Let's go. Three more. Two more. Champion. One more. Woo! Get up. Put your hands up. Nice work, my friends. Good job today. Feet together. Skeet. Right. See you next time. Fist bump.